So this the type of content YouTube pushing out. Oh, okay. Hey y'all, welcome and welcome back. It's one of your faves. See today's topic is what type of content the algorithm is favoring right now and why. First, let's quickly understand how the YouTube algorithm works. Now the algorithm is designed to keep viewers on the platform by showing them content they're more likely to enjoy. Now it considers factors like your watch time, engagement, and users behavior. So if you know what type of content it's favoring, you can tell your videos for maximum exposure. Now let's explore the type of content that the algorithm is currently pushing out. Number one, shorts. YouTube shorts are gaining massive traction. These bite-sized videos are not only quick to consume, but also encourage higher engagement rates. Now the algorithm loves content that keeps viewers watching and with shorts, users are more likely to scroll through multiple videos in one city. Number two, live stream. Live content creates a sense of urgency and excitement. The algorithm promote live videos due to their real time engagement potential. Now when you go live, viewers can interact with you instantly, making them more likely to stay and participate. Number three, community centric content. Now videos that foster community interactions such as Q&As and challenge videos are favorable. Now the algorithm recognizes high engagement and comments which can boost your visibility. Number four, trending topics. Capitalize on current events or trending topics can give your content a significant boost. Now the algorithm tends to push videos that align with what's hot right now, making it easier for your new audience to find you. Okay, so why is it that the algorithm favor these type of content more right now? Increased engagement. Content like shorts and live streams keep users engaged for longer periods of time. So when viewers spend more time watching it, it signals to the algorithm that your content content is valuable. Higher retention rates. The algorithm tracks how long viewers stay on your videos. Short engaging content tend to have a higher retention rate, which will boost your chances of being recommended to more viewers. Community interactions. Videos that encourage comments, likes, and also shares create a sense of community. The algorithm rewards this behavior by promoting videos that viewers interact with, creating a cycle of engagement. Timeless videos. Covering trending topics attract immediate attention. Now, when you create timely content, you tap into existing viewers' interests, making it more likely that your video will gain traction more quickly. Now that you know what the algorithm favors and why, here are some tips for creating content that might align with these trends. Number one, experiment with shorts. Start incorporating shorts into your channel. These quick videos can be fun and also creative, allowing you to showcase your personality or niche in new ways. Number two, engage in real time. Plan live streams regularly. Promote them in advance to gather an audience and be sure to interact with your viewers during your entire live stream by addressing their comments and also their questions. Number three, leverage current trends. Stay updated with trending topics and also create content around them. Use tools like Google Trends or Twitter to find out what's buzzing. Number four, create community-driven content. Encourage your audience to participate by asking for their input or creating challenges. This not only engages your audience, but also boosts your video's visibility. So with all that being said, I have done a lot of research and these are the conclusions that I came up with. So my channel is an information channel. So a lot of these trending viral tips and tricks that are online will not help me, but my job is to get it out to your channel, which it can help. Now, will it help mine eventually? I hope so. But y'all know I'm here for y'all. And like I always say, shorts, shorts, shorts. Shorts is a great way to get a new audience, gain subscribers, get your retention up, your watch time up. Shorts really help with that because as we know, people have a very short attention span nowadays, okay? Our lives are so hectic, so when we sit down, we want to look at something funny and scroll. We want to look at something that's DIY. You know, we just want to look at something really quick and say, oh, okay, I like that. Maybe you'll share it. Maybe you'll try it. So try doing YouTube shorts. Try going live. That's the easiest way as well to gain new subscribers and gain a new audience. It's by going live because it's in real time. So anything they ask you, you can answer back right then. 
people love that okay people really 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 do love that and try promoting your videos once you post your videos don't forget to send them to other platforms okay now yesterday i made a video on send your youtube videos over to other platforms and i had a comment that said i will send it everywhere but facebook and i 100 percent agree with them guys for some reason, the Facebook audience is very judgmental. They're very spammy. They're very trolly. Like if you post your YouTube videos or clips over to Facebook, for some reason, you get more bad backlash and feed than ever. So I'm still trying to figure out exactly what type of audience is over there on Facebook because they're not friendly over there. Facebook audience are not all, not all. But majority of them are very judgmental over there. What's going on? So you know what? Don't bring them over here. Don't we? We don't need them. We'll leave them. We'll we'll hang out with them over there. You know how you have friends that you hang out with, but you hang out with from afar. We'll leave Facebook over there. Cause fa mm -mm. <laughs> So do what's best for you. Try to find out what's going to work. Look through your niche. Find gaps, fill the gaps, do what makes you happy, stay authentic, just stay authentic guys. And the way YouTube is set up now, social media period, it's so hard to be authentic, but I promise you, if you be authentic and be yourself, it will shine through. People will love you for you. If you gain an audience, you want them to love you for you, not because of this character you've created or some trend that's going on. Continue to be you. They will love you for you and it will last way longer than the character that you make up. So if you have any questions, please feel free to comment down below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, your girl seeing is out.